Hey guys, Buck 590 here, coming to you with another action figure review. This time we're looking at the Mandroid Build-A-Figure, Captain America, the Winter Soldier movie, Marvel Legends Infinite Series, the Black Widow action figure by Hasbro. You can see right here, Black Widow in the packaging with the extra head sculpt, the Mandroid body and the gun, and the two extra hands, in case you want to swap the hands, swap the head. Over here I got the same picture of Captain America throwing a shield, on the other side Captain America throwing a shield. On the top we have the same shield logo and over here on the back we got the picture of the figure and the description. Former spy and deadly assassin Natasha Romanoff may, be, may have read in her ledger but Black Widow plans to settle accounts. Very nice. And over here you got the rest of the figures in this wave. There's a Mandroid figure you have to build or complete if you want. But yeah, very excited. I haven't been able to find these in stores for like months so Let's open these bad boy up and see how hot she really okay, is. Hey guys, well, here we have the Black Widow opened up and out of her packaging. Now, for starters, some of the accessories that she does come with are the extra hand pieces. She has an extra, extra open palm hand right here, you can see, and another gun wielding hand. She comes with one of each on each pair of hand, so you can interchange them if you'd like. And she also comes with the Avengers short hair style that she donned in the Avengers so you can have her either pose with the Avengers or with Captain America in her new long hair look when the, the, in Captain America the Winter Soldier movie so looking very cool very foxy you can see right there on the figure that she is really nicely sculpted looking really cool and she does look yeah, she has a resemblance to Scarlett Johansson, definitely. Now I have her holding one of Dutch's guns from the NECA Predator line. And I think it suits her hand pretty well. It doesn't slip off or anything, it's a nice fit. And because the guns, you know, that do come with her, don't really come off. They're just kind of part of her sculpt. So you can't really do much with those. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the accessories. Now let's look at the head sculpt. The head sculpt looks great. I think it's a really nice likeness to Scarlett Johansson. And the hair is looking really nice as well. You can see. Nicely sculpted hair. It's got the Avengers shield logo right there on the side. And the hair as well. It's got the zipper, you know, you gotta align it correctly though, so the zipper can be aligned with the rest of the lining right there. Her belt, really, really cool, I love this figure. It's great, because now I can add her to the Avengers um, collection that I have going on there, in my display cabinets. Look at that Black Widow butt. What? So yeah, um, some pieces do seem to be kind of like, extra or something, you can just peel them off, you know, no big deal. But... Um, I don't see it as a major damage to the figure. It's pretty much, you know, you're not really going to see the, the back, back part that much anyway. So, as for the articulation, the arms can go in and out, barely. Um, they can go also forward and back. Uh, no cut right there in the bicep. One single jointed elbow right there. Hand can go around 360, no movement other than that. Same with the other hand. The head can go around, I think can go around 360. Well, it's kind of, you know, the long hair kind of like alters it, but if she had the Black Widow head on, you know, it would be able to go more. So, well, that's easily detachable. <laughs> Body can go around also 360. But because of the alignment of the zipper, it'll look weird. So trying to keep that right there in the middle. Legs can go forward and back. This is detached, so you have you know no issues in with whether it'll break or not. Because if it were to attach the figure, you wouldn't be able to move it at all. But it's not attached, so and it's got nice little die cut right there. Double jointed knees, so that's good. And you got some articulation here in the boots, and the little high heels, so. Looking very cool. Let's see how she looks like with the other head sculpt since the head was so easily taken off. Uh, 
Oh, looking nice. So yeah, like I said, either way, you know, you get a Black Widow figure, which we've wanted from Hasbro for a while now. And now we've got it. So very cool. Time to add this to the collection. <laughs> Some people would, you know, probably buy two, just one, so you can have this head sculpt, the other one can have the other one, but I'm content with just one of this figure. So, that's pretty much it for me, guys. Like this video if you enjoyed it, or if you enjoy Scarlett Johansson. She's very enjoyable, am I right? And don't forget to subscribe if you already haven't. More videos coming soon. Make sure you haven't, if you haven't already, then watch Captain America The Winter Soldier. Very great movie. Comes out on DVD, on DVD and Blu-ray September 9th, I think. So if you missed it in theaters, then you'll have to wait till September 9th to be able to buy that bad boy. That's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching.